protesters have clashed with police in Burundi a day after President Pierre Nkurunziza was controversially announced as a candidate for a third term in office. Hundreds defied a ban on demonstrations to take to the streets of the capital Bujumbura. The protesters threw stones at police who responded with tear gas. President Nkurunziza was nominated by his governing CNDDFDD party, a move opponents say is unconstitutional. They warn it threatens a peace deal that ended the country's 12-year civil war in 2005, which killed more than 300,000 people. More than 8,000 people have fled to neighboring countries in recent weeks citing violence ahead of June's presidential election, the UN Refugee Agency says. Sunday's protests are the latest against Mr Nguranziza's bid for another term. Police blocked off roads leading to the center of Bujumbura, with tense standoffs developing the BBC's Maud Jolyon reported. At his nomination by a special party congress, the president said, I call people to go to the election in peace. But I would like to warn everyone, whoever wants to create problems with the ruling party elected by the people, he'll find himself in trouble, he added, Reuters reported. Mr Nguranziza has served two terms as president, coming to the office at the end of the civil war. Burundi's constitution only allows the president to be elected twice. But Mr Nguranziza's supporters argue he is eligible for another term since he was appointed by parliament in 2005.